This is the final weekend of the Florida Strawberry Festival, which is over uh, the years, has really become known uh, for top musical acts coming to Plant City. Yeah, they've had some great groups. And as ABC Action News reporter Eric Waxler finds out, sometimes that means performers could be on the cusp of superstardom. Before Taylor Swift was selling out stadiums, she was here in Plant City on the stage in 2009 at the Florida Strawberry Festival. Back in the day, everybody came through the festival, especially the country acts. In 2009, Paul Davis had just become president of the festival, and Taylor Swift was the first act he signed. When she did her meet and greets with fans, every single person she talked to, she complimented something about them and was the nicest person. Back then, Paul says the Strawberry Festival let people sit in the grandstands for free. There were 4,000 seats. But it became a safety issue when 8,000 people lined up early that afternoon. Well, I went backstage, I knocked on the bus, and her mother came to the door and said that, uh, she goes, yes, and I said, I told her the problem, and Taylor came running down the stairs and, and said, I want to see, this is so exciting. I remember walking on the stage that night and seeing um, a crowd of people that I had never seen at the Strawberry Festival before. Lauren McNair was the festival queen that year and not only went to the concert, but got to meet Taylor too. Both were 19 years old. She started talking to us about how high the stage was, that she hoped she didn't fall off that night, and she just talked to us like she was one of our friends from high school. Since playing the Strawberry Festival, Taylor's been back to Tampa several times, playing before much bigger crowds. She's got three concerts coming up next month at Raymond James Stadium. But Lauren says, like a lot of fans, she'll have to miss seeing the show this time around. I couldn't spend eight hours on the phone getting tickets. Um, so I won't be at her show, but I will always remember um, the great experience that I had with her 14 years ago. In Plant City, Eric Waxler, ABC Action News.